Bonjour, ni hao. Welcome back to the Game Boys channel. I'm Johnny. And I'm Tim. And today we're here with Loungefly Mystery, Mystery Pins. Pins! So they've been coming out with so many Loungefly Pins lately. It's been crazy. Which is kind of good because the parks have been kind of dropping the ball. And all the new ones at the parks are like, we don't want. No, all the Loungefly Mystery Pins, there are so many new collections that I keep looking at. I'm like, Tim, I might want these. You know, they just came out with a Hocus Pocus one. Mm -hmm. That's going to be pre-ordered, but we definitely want those. What other The ones? backpacks I'm really excited about. Um, the, and the pins that we have here. Yes. What's actually really funny is one of these that we're opening is something that I thought it was something else. <laughs> so I'll put the picture of what I thought it was here. So those were the ice cream cone princess pins, and these are the self-serve ice cream Christmas pin, Christmas pins, princess pins, <laughs> which um, these are actually, I think, a little bit better because in this one you get 10, and on the other box you only have six options. And I personally like soft serve in a cup better than an ice cream cone just because it's easier to eat and you can add more toppings anyways. So I'm not mad about this. Although the other pack does have Aurora oh. as a chase as her blue and pink dress as a scoop. This one has no Auroras I just noticed. These are all the ones that you can get. So you have Snow White, Belle, Ariel, Jasmine, Tiana, Mulan. And then you have Moana, which you never see, and then Rapunzel, Pocahontas, and Cinderella. I like all of the little things on top. Yeah, it's but really fun. They what always do really cool designs. They should have put a shoe on Cinderella's, but they did not. So if you guys have, haven't noticed, I am wearing my princess shirt and my kind of like ears that remind me of princesses a little bit because the other set we're doing is Cinderella. These are all glittery too. So there's the fairy godmother, Cinderella's original dress made by the mice, the f lady mice, which you never see, and then you have Jock and the slipper, and then you have Jack and Gus Gus with all the ribbon and the pearls. And then, oh, uh, this loose fur one is the chaser. We really, really want that one. A lot of these lounge fly pins are like selling out a lot of places. Box Lunch um, is getting like very few of them. I've noticed that they're actually now going on the lounge fly website and then like other sellers are reselling them. So these Cinderella ones we bought off of lounge flies website. And then these self-serve ones we got from Box Lunch, but they're already sold out. So we were only able to get five boxes of these ones. So, yeah. What is your favorite that you want out of this? Out of all of these, I probably want the Tangled one or the Ariel. Yeah. Or Jasmine. Yeah, I would say that my top is Rapunzel just because it looks really, really pretty. And my second would probably be Moana, because, like, you never see her. And we only have, like, maybe, like, three pins of actual Moana. I always go first. You should go first. Okay. Don't mind if I do. Oh, yeah. I'm so excited. We haven't done pins in so long. It has been a very long time. Long to us is, like, two weeks. <laughs> Me too, also. Okay, so they come in a little black blind bag. And then you can't really feel these because these are all the same shape. <gasps> is it the one we want? Is it tangled? <gasps> Yay! <It's Rapunzel. gasps> oh, that is a pretty this pin. This is really pretty. And you could see like the sun and then all the little lanterns coming up in the pink soft surf. Oh, I love the pretty gold background. Oh, that's cute. What flavor do you think that is? Cotton candy? Strawberry, maybe? Okay. My turn. <laughs> He's usually my lucky charm with these pins. <gasps> oh! I got the one that my favorite princess. 
Ariel? Yes! <laughs> you had to hesitate. I was like, <gasps> oh, oh, it's God. so pretty. And I like that they have the waffling on the back now with the Disney. And it's a Disney waffled crown, I mm -hmm. think. Yeah, because they're doing the crown because um, of the Funko merge. Because Funko's symbol is the crown. The more you know. Oh, fun. So, like, we did those perfume bottles, and Ariel was the hardest, hardest to get. <laughs> so now yeah, we have Ariel. I think that flavor is mint pistachio. <laughs> oh, that looks good. And I love the shell pattern. And, yeah, this is the back of the pen if anyone was wondering. Oh, fun. We got two good ones. I am very surprised, though, that... Aurora is not on this. Comment below on what your favorite flavor of ice cream is because it's summertime. It's time for sweet, cold treats. <laughs> I'm becoming more accustomed to ice cream. I used to like not like it, but since I got my wisdom teeth out and that's like all I could eat, I kind of like, I'm into it now. I love ice Mint cream. chocolate chip. Is oh, is that the Ariel? Because it's kind of minty. Maybe. I think pistachio would be teen. Oh, you're right. It yeah. is that green color. Box number three. Let's see what we have. Oh, uh, no boobies, no boobies. <gasps> Yay! We got a new one. And it is Belle. This one's kind of simple. See, is that, a, is that la lemon ice cream? Like a lemon cello? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not very well versed in the ice creams. I think it's just flavors. So this is Belle up close. This looks really pretty. And I like how simple it is, but I don't know if it'll come up, but there is a very subtle glitter element in this. All right. Who else have we missed? Jasmine. I want Jasmine. I'm manifesting this one to be Jasmine's. Jasmine. Manifestations are real people. Jasmine. Is this Jasmine? It's Jasmine. Or Cinderella would be cool too. Oh, no, but I did just manifest a new pin, and it is pistachio flavored. Oh, yeah. Tiana. Oh, see, like, look at the little... Is that a frog? I think there's a frog. I can't tell. My eyes are really bad when it comes to looking at things that tiny and glossy. <laughs> no, it's not the frog. Oh, yeah, it is a frog. Ha! I was right, it was a frog. <laughs> I was looking at the lily pad on the bottom. <laughs> so these are kind of tiny, but if you could see on the top right here that's a little frog with a crown and then you have like the lily pad down here that resembles her dress and this color is beautiful yay so we have one more left hoping it's something new if i had to choose i would say moana but for you i'd be okay with jazz oh thank you honey <laughs> I, okay, you know what? I will manifest Moana for you. I am manifesting Moana. It's Moana. It's a Moana pen. Is it Jasmine? <laughs> he totally lied. He was pretending he wanted Jasmine all along. Oh, that oh that's like a rasp or a blueberry flavored ice cream. That's really cool, the bottom of right? it. Right, and with the, the lamp on the top. See, I like the jasmine pen. Yeah, this one has really cool details. The bottom, which is her signature color and beautiful, and then you have her little, like, hair piece on there, and then the genie lamp. This is really pretty. This would be one of those ice creams that's, like, too pretty to eat. You just want to like walk around with it for like pictures. It's like the hey hey cone. <laughs> like that one yeah. you don't want to eat. Uh, oh, five for five. We did awesome. Good job. Ah, uh, let's hope this continues because we're on to the Cinderella pins next. Right, there's only one thing I'm manifesting in this box. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, they're all cool. I just don't want doubles. Yeah, so the number one I would want on this obviously would be a Lucifer, but it is the Chase. And then the next one, I would say Cinderella's dress because we collect all of those dress pins and that would be cool to add like her original because we have her uh, dress when she's cleaning and then her, the dress 
Obviously. Her, like, like blue, blue dress. Blue. But we don't have her homemade dress Which by the Which one do you want? Lucifer. Well, what other one? If I had to pick a second one, I would say I probably would pick uh, Jacques and Gus Gus sewing because I like sewing. All right, am I going first this time? Mm -hmm. All right, opening a box. Throwing the box. Black baggy. Okay, these black baggies are much smaller. This feels like a... L okay, this pin is large. Mm -hmm. That's a good sign. Oh my god, this pin's huge. Wow. Right? Like, that's a... I was not expecting... Cool. Like, right? Okay. Oh, and look at the nice. rose gold background. Oh my god. I'm... Okay. How is she, that's though? That's stunning. I didn't think I needed this pin, but now I have it. Oh my god, these are really big for Like, me. that's what I'm saying, right? Like... But lounge play <laughs> pins are usually small, but... <laughs> oh my gosh. And what's funny is we just unboxed a couple months ago the Cinderella 75th mm. anniversary pins. If you haven't seen that, we'll link it above. But holy cow, this is amazing. And I can't wait to add this to the rest of those. Look how, I don't know if you could tell how Here, big this show is. Show how big it is compared next to the Dole Whip. Or to the ice cream cone. This is what it's like compared to the ice cream cone. <laughs> yeah, so it's like... Double. Almost three times the size. But what's even cooler is the back is a rose gold finish with that really pretty lounge fly crown backing. And like the tints and stuff are also rose gold. Oh my god, this is stunning. And it has a lot of glitter on the shoe. I'm glad we got this one though. I did not know I needed it, but now that we have it, I'm very, like, I live for this it. This is really cool. I love that. That's also, I'm not gonna lie, that's a really low heel. That's a kitten heel. <laughs> <laughs> that's almost a flat Cinderella. Well, wasn't she like 16? <laughs> <laughs> Young the princesses were True. in the movies. All right. <laughs> Next box. This one feels light, so I don't think it's going to be a duplicate. Throw it. These are like jammed in these little baggies. Okay, it's rose gold. <gasps> Yay! We got our dress. <gasps> and that's is that bigger than the other dress? No, these pins? are the same size okay. as the dress pins. That is such a pretty rose gold color. I never see really pins in this pretty. in that. You. <gasps> uh, oh, oh, look at the glitter. See, yeah, maybe the dress pins don't have glitter on them. So maybe this will stand out. <laughs> so this is so pretty. You could see the glitter reflecting off the light. And the bows really stand out. And there's even glitter on the white part of the dress. Which is amazing. Yay. So I'm really excited to get this one. Hopefully... Lucifer, we get all our favorites. Anastasia and Drizella would be jealous of that dress. <laughs> I, I don't make any pins of them. Hardly ever. Okay. <gasps> oh, I don't do It's not okay. This is not pin that what well, pin that we wanted. Oh, it's the girls. But it's the girl mice. It is good to have. When you look at you them, you never see them. They're the way their glitter dresses are, and the way like the bowl of thread it or the spool of thread is in a rose gold, it's going to give you very Sleeping Beauty vibes. <laughs> Do you see what I'm saying? And I never noticed that all of the mice have different colored dresses. I love Sleeping Beauty. That's really cool. This one's kind of bigger than normal. Still not as big as the shoe. And you still have the rose gold goodness and all the glitter on their dresses. And these girls are adorable. They're just like... Let's help Cinderella, Cinderella. Oh, this is a cool one. Yeah, it actually does kind of look like the three fairies from Cinderella or from Sleeping Beauty. And you do love a good trio of girls, Tim. And they made it pink. Make it blue. <laughs> Can we do it? Oh God, I really hope so. But I mean, if we get a new one, I wouldn't be mad. And the fairy godmother is really cute. We do have quite a few pins of her, but... Does it feel like a cat? Manifest cat! 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 Think about cat. Cats. Cats. Cat. Is okay, it... it's not a double. So wait, is it the one that I wanted? The one of the sew them sewing? Jacques and Gus Gus? <laughs> Yay! <gasps> so this one's really cool. I love the shape of that. I don't like how small the mice are, though. 
It's like you can't really see them that much. No, but I like how there's blue and pink yeah, and, and his gold. slippers there, which is cool. I really like how Cinderella's slippers there, and then you have the famous button and the thingy that the thread goes through. <laughs> a needle? That whole thing. That's called a needle. And then this is really pretty. You have the glitter on there, and then you have Jock and Gus dancing or doing something crazy up there. That's the eye of the needle. It's called the eye of the needle. I don't sew. <laughs> um, wow. Tim, we opened nine pins and we got zero no duplicates. duplicates. That never happened. That's a good day. Wow. And this, this shoe pin. <laughs> that is everything. What is your favorite out of each? My favorite out of each. The first, my favorite Cinderella pin is clearly the shoe, because I was not expecting to enjoy it that much. My second is the dress. My favorite, uh, princess pin would probably have to be Tangle. It's the one I always wanted. Second is Jasmine. So my favorite pin, I thought it would be the dress of Cinderella, but it's Jack, Jock, Jock in the shoe. And then I thought it would be Tangled Rapunzel, but I actually really like the Jasmine better. These are all of them up close. And no duplicates. Can you imagine? So crazy. That never happens. Maybe we should pre-order stuff more. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe when you pre-order them, they're like nicer or they're in like more distinctive wrapping so it's like not all like the same and jumbled around and stuff maybe i don't know the but yeah goes. let us know what your guys favorite pin of each set we got was this is really cool i'm actually really excited to see the cones snow cones because those sold out everywhere that i've looked and i was like oh i got them i got them and then these came and i was like are these the same but they're not but i really like these like I said before, just because there are more options, and you never see Moana. And yeah, these Cinderella ones are everything. I'm very surprised by the Cinderella pins. When Tim first showed them to me, I was not as <laughs> much in love with them, because I was like, I don't love them as much. But the fact that they're rose gold. Zoom in on this moment here as he's talking smack. Cinderella's like, <gasps> how dare you? <laughs> and Jasmine, too, she's like, you didn't pick my pin as a favorite. Thank you so much for joining us today. If you had a good time with this pin unboxing, please take a moment to give this video a like. And if you're not a subscriber and enjoy Disney pins, we would love for you to consider hitting that subscribe button so you'll be notified of future Disney pin unboxings, unboxings in general. We games, have a lot more Loungefly pins coming also. True story. <laughs> games and lifestyle related content. And if you are a subscriber, thank you so much for sending us all of your good juju so that we had a <laughs> duplicate list unboxing and until our next video take care and be well Thanks. bye